Good evening and thank you for joining us on News Watch. I'm Josh Larson. And I'm Lexi Hanna. Tonight we begin with an Iowa State twist that the bed bug saga that has swept the nation over the summer. That's right. Over the summer there seemed to be an unlimited supply of stories about those bed bugs, whether they were in hotels or local businesses. In Des Moines, even one person released the pest into the city's armory building, forcing it to be heated to 135 degrees just to eliminate the issue. ISUTV's Rachel Begley reports tonight on a bed bug issue that may have hit Iowa State University. Universities, hotels, and homes across the country all have a pesky problem. You don't have to look far to find the source of this problem. In fact, all you have to do is look beneath your sheets. Bed bug infestations are popping up everywhere, unfortunately, even in Ames. The tan blood sucking bugs have been found in hotels and homes in the area, as well as in Iowa State's Schilliter University apartments. Iowa State Manager of Residence Hall Maintenance Richard Gary explains that it is hard to tell if you have a bed bug problem because different people have different reactions to the pests. The bed bug bite itself will react differently to different people. You could get bit by a bed bug and have absolutely no reaction. I could get bit by a bed bug and I will have a, anything from a small looking welt to a large welt. Richard also recommends that students stay away from used furniture and says furniture set on the curb is very likely to be infested with the pests. Richard explains that the best way to check your bed for the bugs is simply to strip your mattress and check the seams. And what I brought out is this is a typical mattress that we use here on campus and what you'll find is, is if you have bed bugs is that you'll actually see little black droppings around this seam and then what you do is when you lift the seam up you'll actually see live bed bugs. These are visible. People don't think you know, that, that they're invisible. No, they're not invisible. They're very visible. You actually can't tell if you have bed bugs in your bed. One way the university is trying to combat these pests is by switching to mattresses with plastic lining and inside seams. The bugs can't climb on the plastic lining and with seams on the inside these bugs have no place to hide. Students living in university housing who think they may have a bed bug problem are urged to contact the service center at 515-294-3322. Keeping you bed bug free, I'm Rachel Begley for Newswatch. While there's only been one reported case at Iowa State, health officials still recommend checking whenever possible for those bed bugs.